guys and welcome back to my channel it's your girl brandy chanel coming to you with another video and i know i'm looking a little bit basic and i'm okay with that i I'm, I'm having a basic kind of day today um but i'm gonna come to you with one that i have not done in a long long time and i just wanted to film it because i like these videos i still um even though you guys don't view them often i still like them so i'm gonna go ahead and view it and i mean i'm going to go ahead and film it and it's gonna be my ipsy um, unboxing and um, I'm gonna also do boxy charm and I'm gonna have on the same outfit so just act like you didn't see this outfit before if you see one before you see the other okay but here's my ipsy bag my ipsy glam bag and here is the bag this month it's really cool everybody's face is blank um, this one is kind of childish but not real I like it I like this one I do like this one um, this one is just create this one is the theme is create and it's Mip ipsy march 2018 what makes this one kind of childish is that it comes with markers for you to i guess color your bag if you want to i will be giving these to my five-year-old son he will be happy to have a blue and green marker um but let's go ahead and get into the contents on the inside of the box so first thing i'm going to pull out is the bag i'm sorry first thing i'm going to pull out is this skin and co roma truffle therapy whipped polishing cleansing cream with truffle extract um it's just a whipped cleansing cream that's made in italy and um i like i've said before i really like getting small travel size um, skincare products in my bags because it gives you an opportunity to try out different things and um, see what you like what you don't like excuse me and um, they're also very good for travel so if you're somebody who travels often throwing one of these in your bag instead of having to pack your huge cleanser is definitely more convenient so I do like getting skincare products in my ipsy glam bag so there's that one next item is just this city color glow duo and it is a highlighting palette one side is cream one side is powder and let's see they're pretty good size actually and to me i'm i'm actually surprised because for me i feel like this is a pretty dark highlighter so unless it came in different shades some of our vanilla sisters will might not be able to wear that because that's kind of dark they may be able to use it as a bronzer now this one they could probably use but this one it seems a little dark i can use it i feel like and it may even be a little dark for me but that is what it looks like i'm gonna swatch both it's very creamy to the touch it's like a sorry y'all know my lighting is pretty awful at times it's like a rose gold you can well actually more copper you can see the flux there and that is the powder highlight guys and even that may be a little dark for my cheeks this might be like a blush topper but it's really pretty let's see what the cream side looks like and it, it was very soft to the touch it was very creamy I'm gonna swipe the cream one right next to it now the cream one I can definitely do it's right here and it just has a nice sheen to it so I do like that I don't really use cream products like that but this is pretty you could even use it as like I said a blush topper on the eyeshadow but for me as a highlight it might be too dark oh I wish you guys could see like I can see it in my mirror in the mirror it's really very pigmented very shiny very pretty just too dark next I have a brush it's from scone and it is the large shadow brush I have already told you guys I love receiving brushes in these boxes it's so convenient these boxes these subscriptions should I say it's so convenient and I it just is a great way to build up your um your brush collection really it really is next thing I got was this Hikari Cosmetics Cream Pigment in the shade Shine. This is the packaging. And I've had Hikari products in um, Ipsy before. They're very easy to depot and they do fit, they do go into a uh, Z palette. So if you're curious, you can just pop it out of that plastic and pop it in the Z palette. I'm going to go ahead and swatch it. Like I said, it is a cream product. It is like a 
bronzy gold look at how look at how reflective that is that's so pretty I'm gonna swatch it right next to that um, highlighter that is beautiful actually I could definitely see myself you see that I could definitely see myself using that as like a base for an eye, like an eyeshadow base or even um, just on its own as an eyeshadow I just like I said I don't really and I still have products on my finger look at that um, um, wow, that's, <laughs> I just made a whole nother swatch, and I still have product on my, let's just see how many swatches <laughs> I can get, okay, okay, now I think it's wearing about down, but I've got, look at all those swatches from that one swipe I did, it's a really pretty color, I like it a lot, it's like a bronzy gold color, and I, it's not like too tacky so I mean you could be okay with without setting it I think but I do have a Juvia's Place palette that has a color very comparable to that so I feel like if you use this as a base and put something like that on top it would really like really be good it would be A1 and then last but not least is this just <laughs> last but not least is just this really cute little Sex Kitten Liner from Tarte. It is a pencil liner. And you just roll it up like that. Um, I I love getting these kind of things too. Like guys, I I actually like getting Ipsy because they send deluxe size samples um things and um things like these are very nice to just throw into my travel um makeup pouch i am gonna do a video on that so you guys can see it i have a full face of makeup in a tiny like itty bitty um pouch so um i'm gonna do a video on that to show you guys that but this is perfect to go into that like something like this and like a sample size like mascara um these things are perfect for that so that you don't have to be um traveling with a whole bunch of makeup but you can still achieve a full face of flawless makeup so I really like that too like receiving small things like that too and guys that is my ipsy bag for the month of what is this March um I have gone over it in my mind several times about canceling ipsy but I I've decided not to number one because it's only ten dollars um, and granted you're getting five deluxe size sometimes regular size sample size items um, but I like receiving them because for the purposes that I said like if you're going out of town if you're traveling or something like that it just makes it easier so that you don't have to pack all these huge things and when I think about it it's only ten dollars it's not worth my headache for me to cancel it actually so um, I'm going to keep receiving it. Like I said, I really like this month's bag for sure. Um, that's all I have. It doesn't compare by far to BoxyCharm, let's be clear. But it is a really, it is still a really good subscription and I do like it most times. There's not a lot of times that I find that I don't like something that came in the Ipsy. So that is my Ipsy Glam bag for this month and I will be filming my BoxyCharm here in just a second. And guys, it is a good box, okay? I will see you next time. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and bye.